What is up guys, welcome back to the channel, my name is Shane and welcome to another quick episode here on 5 Star Cars where I just give my thoughts and opinions on what's going on in the supercar community on YouTube and on today's quick episode we're just going to be covering um, DD's uh, Aperta build and just uh, Straven's latest uh, video as well. Uh, before we get into it guys, do remember, again, link in the description below, vote for your 2020 car YouTuber of the year. The link, just clicking the link it can take you two seconds, multiple choice there, I did the best I could with the list. So if there's anybody in that list that you like, it just takes you one click and you, the vote is done. Um, consider subscribing guys because I will reveal the uh, winner on January 1st. Um, and also give it a like uh, if you don't mind. Uh, we're aiming for 2,000 sub guys, so that's kind of the plan. And as I said, I'm in the process of building up this office as well indeed. Uh, so as I said, this video is about DD's new Aperta build. It's finally finished. Uh, what do I think of it? Um, I think it looks really cool. I do like it. They've gone down a different direction to a lot of, di uh, a lot of channels. Uh, we know DD like uh, pushing the ball out and being different than anybody else, which is pretty cool. Um, it's all, I think it's 840 brake horsepower. Uh, I really like the neon yellow color on it. Um, and it must have cost them a fortune to get that done. Like I, I can only imagine how much it cost them to 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 actually do it. Um, I think uh, will somebody let me know in the comments below. Is this a one on one build? As in like there's nobody else has done this. Uh, is there other? I know there's a Ferrari part there. I can't remember what other partners are out there if people would let me know, but is this the first Lamborghini part there? Um, you know, obviously DD are going to get huge. Uh, I think a lot of places are, are saying it's one of the biggest things going on in the supercar community at the moment. Um, and I can't wait to see it in full action and the way it's driven and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know the laws, it will they be able to drive it over in Canada, I think as long as they have a helmet on. But um, I really like it. The divorce liner of Forge Carbon Kitten is, is really, really nice. Uh, but yeah, let me know guys in the comments below. We'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions. And um, you know, I suppose the next build we'll have is the R34. And speaking of that, I did just see, is it Win Motion TV, I think it is? Uh, he has his S14 builds up for a raffle or to win. And I just saw the title is Enter the JDM Space. So <laughs> it looks like a lot of, now I don't know if there's other channels have copped onto this. It looks like, uh, there's a lot of places have really kind of the JDM proper channels have really gone and want to take the piss out of the DD for calling it JDM space and making JDM space uh, um, you know uh, Instagram page and stuff like that. I mean, it, I, I, it's just I don't know. It's funny. I don't know what's going to happen with this enter JDM space thing. It, it's just going to be funny to see how it unravels. Uh, so let me know in the comments below guys. Uh, last update as well, it's just going to be a quick one on Stradman's latest video. So he did his latest video with his R35 racing a helicopter. Um, it's a totally, the way it was shot was really cool, I really liked it. Um, like he got to 170, nearly 175 miles an hour. Um, he lost two out of three to the helicopter. It was really, it was a really good video. Um, the question is, it does, like he has said he wants to get a pilot, I don't know if he even has a pilot license, but he does want to get a, a plane. Uh, you wonder if his channel is going to go down that route, um, going into the um, aerospace kind of direction. I'm not into planes or helicopters, it's cool seeing stuff like that, but um, do you think he's going to end up buying a plane uh, and using the plane's footage? to shoot the cars or just do plane footage. Now, if he just goes down and do plane footage and helicopter footage, it wouldn't be for me. I'm not interested in it. If he mix it with the cars and stuff, then yeah, I'd probably watch a bit of it. But let me know, guys, if you think he's going to start changing direction in the new year, new plans, and go down this helicopter and plane route, and would you like it, or would it bother you at all about him doing that as well? So that was just today's video, guys. I uh, hopefully I have a long one out tomorrow, and hopefully my desk comes soon for the bloody office so I can stop sitting on these stupid chairs. Uh, but yeah, till the next episode, guys. Thanks very much if you watched again. Do consider subscribing, get voting below uh, on the link, and do like squad, smash the like button, and I shall see you in the next episode. So until then, stay safe, peace out, and keep it lit.